hello everyone welcome to check leopard channel and in today's video i'm going to show you how to transfer files between your phone and your laptop or desktop computer without any usb cable now the first thing you need to do is take your phone and open the play store app and then search for wi-fi ftp server and then tap on the first option which is wi-fi ftp server and then tap on install and once the app is installed just open it and then allow FTP file server and then tap on start now from here you need to allow access at the bottom here you can see FTP file server so I'm just going to allow access and then go back and as you can see our FTP file server is started now we are going to need this server URL in a second but before that what you need to do is make sure that your phone and your computer is connected to the same Wi-Fi as you can see here my phone is connected to this Wi-Fi and also my computer is connected to the same Wi-Fi now if you don't have Wi-Fi what you can do is just open mobile hotspot and then turn on mobile hotspot and connect your computer to your phone and then that will work as well and once you have done that go to your computer and then open this PC now right click on any empty space and then click on add a network location and then click on next and then click on choose a custom network location and then click on next now in here we are going to type in that same address from our Wi-Fi FTP server which is this address now you need to type in this address only once so just have patience and type it in and after that click on next and then click on next again and then click on next and then click on finish and as you can see here we have just entered uh, the file manager of my phone and if I go to let's say DCIM and copy anything so let's take something from this folder let's copy these two files and then go to our desktop and paste them here as you can see the files are here and you can also copy anything from your computer so let's copy this file and then go to this PC and then enter the phone and then create a new folder or anything so I'm just going to create a new folder and then paste that photo and now if we open the file manager on my phone and then go to internal storage and then DCIM and then go to that new folder you can see that we have received that file very nice and you can do this with any kind of file and I hope this video was helpful if it was please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe